What's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of The Electric Productions. I'm Jay, and today I'm taking PewDiePie's Unspoken Challenge. That's right, he played this game a couple of days ago, getting over it, and I watched that gameplay, and it was hilarious. If you have not checked out his video yet, please by all means give that video uh, a quick view when you get a chance. But when he was playing the game, I kept thinking to myself, oh, I would have done this different, or that doesn't look that hard, or oh, I'm sure I could have done that better. Ha! Yeah, right. So I got the game, I booted it up, um, I gave it a quick try, and uh, just to see if it would run on my system, and my goodness, is this game challenging. This is rage-inducing, hair-pulling, tear-bringing difficult, um, which is not a bad thing. So I'm going to start a new game here. I hadn't gotten very far at all. I barely made it past the first major obstacle, uh, and you are playing as this character who, for whatever reason, is in a pot of water. Uh, <laughs> Now, as you're playing, there is music, and I don't know if it's copyrighted or not because it seems like they're real songs. Um, so I went ahead and turned those off, and then I also turned off the gentleman who made this game um, actually voices some different dialogue where he talks to you about comparisons between this game and real life and different things like that. It's really cool, actually, and I like it a lot. I just turned it off uh, so that it wouldn't be distracting as we are trying to make some progress. And I'm already stuck on this stupid tree. So let's try launching ourselves. There we go. Now we're making progress. And I did leave the subtitles on so you can see when he would be talking and some of the stuff he'd be saying if you care to read that. So that's the first, that's like the introduction, that little area here. And then we get to like the foot of this mountain. Now I'm actually doing, nope, I was, I spoke too soon. I was going to say I'm actually doing pretty good here. This roof is the first major obstacle, and that's because it is incredibly steep and slick, and your hammer uh, will not grab hold of it. So one of the things you can do is you can use this technique of sort of launching yourself up in the air a little bit. Oh, come on. And momentum is key in this game, and it's both a help and a hindrance. So gaining momentum will launch you uh, to higher heights, but it's also easy to lose all your progress very quickly if you gain too much momentum, lose control, and send yourself flying, like I just did. Not on purpose. That was an accident. Um, and then it's surprising how you'll do really well for a while, and you're like, yeah, I got this, I understand it, I got the controls down, and then all of a sudden, something happens, and it's like, you can't get past this starting little rock alcove there and ore, and you're just like, what, what happened? I, I thought I was past all of this, I thought I had this down. Um, <laughs> you can change the sensitivity a little bit, uh, under settings, but just be warned, if you turn it down too low, uh, then you risk uh, making it where it's hard to launch yourself up. If the sensitivity is too low, you have to do really crazy mouse movements. I'm going to try and launch myself up. Launch myself up. No! <laughs> and that's, this is the game in a nutshell. Um, it's super easy to make grievous errors that set you way back and like this, I'm, I'm just trying to, I'm, I'm just trying to get ahead, man. I'm just trying to get ahead. That coffee cup, though. So, uh, yeah, and if you have the sensitivity turned up too high, then every little movement is liable to send you flying. I've got my sensitivity turned up pretty high right now uh, because I find that it's easier to launch yourself. It requires um, a little bit more careful mouse movement as I'm doing just terrible, um, but I find it's still easier. No, no, no. <laughs> Getting your guy to do what you want is just, it is maddening. It is really maddening. I, I'm trying to get my guy to set down on this barrel right now. I'm trying so hard to do that, and he is just like not having it. The easiest way to do this section, honestly, that i found is to try to launch yourself up here, grab on here, I've already messed it up, and then throw yourself up to that next section. It's just hard to get yourself to angle um, to the right there. 
Um, the game, though, even though the controls are very difficult, I would still say that it's not as maddening as, like, Quop. if you've played Quop, um, This game is based off of a title called Sexy Hiking, which I have not played, um, so I can't really speak to, but that was sort of the author's, um, the, the maker, the dev's inspiration. Um, but for me, this reminds me a lot of those styles of games where it's all about you versus the game and the obstacles that the game has to throw at you and getting past them without destroying your computer. <laughs> no! Oh, my goodness. Come on. Come on. And then slow movement. No, no. There it is. There it is. Okay. Okay. It's okay. Shh, 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 shh. You're okay. You're okay. We're gonna we're gonna angle this way. That's what we're gonna do. No, 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 no. And we're going to to launch. <laughs> so the thing about the uh, a lot of the the terrain is that your hammer will not um, it won't hold on to it. So that that red um, girder there, my hammer just, it just wants to slide. So what I'm probably going to have to do, and I know if I go over the top of that mountain there on the left, oh, here it is. This is what I need. This is what I need. Come on. Come on. No. Yes. Oh. This is the farthest I've ever gotten. Come on, baby. Come on. Come on, little man in a bucket. This is just is just so just No. 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 <laughs> no. Oh my goodness. Ah. Uh... Okay. What if I go like this? Can I Can I No. Come on. It's it's just just Oh, this is just maddening. And launch! That was the worst launch ever. No, no, no. It's weird, but this, I don't know why, this is just making me think of Thor. If you guys have not seen Thor Ragnarok yet, I highly recommend it. It is hilarious and one of the better Marvel movies I've seen in a long time. Um, I don't remember enjoying one this much since Guardians of the Galaxy or Ant-Man, the first Guardians of the Galaxy. But for some reason, just the hammer, the muscular character, just makes me think of Thor. Guys, I am having a bear of a time with this right here. I, I can see the light there, and I know from watching PewDiePie's video that you can grab onto that light. Nope, that didn't work at all. And I just yelled at you guys. I Stop it. Oh. 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 Let's take a breather here. Let's take a breather. Let's take a breather. Let's take a breather. Let's take a breather. Don't do it. Don't do it. It's a trap. Be better than this. One thing I've noticed as you continue to play, um, it's you'll make w wider and wider circles with your with your mouse, and uh, it, it's better to make smaller movements. I don't know why, but the temptation is is to want to flail your your mouse about, and slow calculated movements win the day here. Um, the bigger your movements, the easier it is to mess up, and um, it's all about it's all about muscle memory in this game. I say as I just <laughs> just there it is, there it is, and then it's okay, it's okay. Shh, yes, good, good job, good job. There you go. <laughs> oh my word. Um, I want to see... 
Please stop. No, 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 no. It's a trap. It's a trap. It's a trap. I want to see all my favorite YouTubers play this game. I do. Is This is the kind of game that uh, I just, I, I want to see people play. It is, it is suffering incarnate. And <laughs> I want to see everybody else suffering. <laughs> There's another game that just came out recently. Um, that freaking girder. When you go to swing your hammer, it 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 hits that and sends you flying back down. So you've got to switch up your your swing angle. What I'm saying right now probably makes zero sense because I'm concentrating so hard that I could be just like it probably just sounds like I'm la 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 la. And I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, come on. I think what I've got to do here is I'm pretty sure I've got to get myself up there, move up, bring myself down, and launch. But I I can't seem to to get the angle right. I'm almost physically shaking right now. <laughs> it's that unnerving. And that rock does not help. Neither does the slope here. Neither do my cringeworthy skills. Oh my goodness. So what I'm... There it is. There it is. Oh, man. So I'm going to go ahead and cut and see if I can if I can get past this point. I might not be able to. This may be, like, my finish line right now. I'm embarrassed to say. Like, I seriously give mad props to, uh, to PewDiePie because I don't know how he got past this point. Like, I don't, I don't know. Like, he made it look... Mm relatively easy getting past this point. And I don't know how he did it. Like, it just seems like this area, like my hammer even seems to be working against me. Here it is. I just sent myself back, like, further than the opening area. <laughs> oh, son of a gun! Oh! And this is when you just, like, your will to, like, breathe just goes away. You're just like, oh, It's just, the air is gone. I can't even get over that initial... So you can see how quickly you can lose all your progress. It's, it's just, it's maddening. It's maddening. This is madness. Come on. We've got this. We've got this. And then you get back to these... There's the coffee cup. Then you get back to these points, and you're like, seriously, what, what's what's the point? What's the point? I'm going to get back up there, only to discover that I still can't beat that part. But you do get better. That's the funny thing. Like... <laughs> you get better, guys. Really. See that? See how much better I'm getting? <laughs> Oh, I just want to cry. I want to cry. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Oh. <laughs> do you guys like games like this? Let's, let me know in the comment section below. Uh, do these kind of these kinds of games are fun for me at least to watch people play? But then when I find myself in the driver's seat, and and when I'm watching other people play, I always think, oh, I could do better. I could do better. Like ah, oh, just all you had to do was this. And then I play it, and I remind myself, that's right, yeah, but you suck at games. That's <laughs> that's the key element that you forgot about there. You know, it's like when you uh, love football, and, and you play a little bit, and it's like you'll watch some of these players, and you're like, really, bro? Like, you couldn't you, you, you couldn't just look up and catch that? No? That was, that was too hard for you, huh? I could have done so much better. And then you get out there, and you're just like, all thumbs. I love the, I love the tink of the hammer. Like, they just, they nailed the sounds of the hammer hitting different objects in the world so perfectly. Oh. 
sometimes I swear that the more I play this, like, my hammer is wearing down and smoothing the rock. Because it actually seems to get... It actually seems to get harder. I know it's not, and I know it's just me, and that I'm getting fatigued. And so I'm, I'm getting... I'm not crying. I have allergies. I have allergies. <laughs> oh my gosh. Are you serious right now? The pain is real. The suffering is real. One thing that I have discovered about this game, and they even say it, and it's it's true. Walking away for um walking away for a few minutes actually helps immensely. Um, I mean, like, just going and getting a glass of water, going to the bathroom. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Seriously. Oh, my word. How many times can I do that, like, in a row? <laughs> oh, my goodness. All right, guys. I mean, fun is fun. <laughs> uh, I give serious props to the gentleman who made this game. Um, it, it's really, it's a thing of beauty, it is. For a game to be this difficult takes an ama This is not an accidental thing. Because you can't just make it where it's impossible. It has to be possible. You have to give the person just enough hope to keep coming back, uh, to to that they can they can make progress. And I've already noticed in the time that I've been playing, I have improved. <laughs> doesn't it doesn't show? I know, but uh, but I have, and that's that's a good game. I mean, that that takes purpose. Dag nabbit. Oh, my insides hurt. Like seriously, I'm not even kidding. Like, I'm not, I'm not even joking. Like, this actually makes me in physical pain. <laughs> so, PewDiePie, you win this round, good sir. Um, I, though, am not giving up. I am not relinquishing. I am not uh, going to be beat. I'm going to continue to practice this game, and I am going to get better. And I will come back for a second match, sir. And un eventually, I will get over it. I will get over this mountain. I don't know how long it's going to take me. It may take me a week. It may take me a month. It may take me a couple of years. But I will continue to play this game and get better at it until the starting area here is a piece of cake and I can get past... <laughs> and I can get past the more challenging uh, parts of this game. But for right now, I'm done. I, I can't take it. I can't take it anymore. I can't take it. I can't take it. I'm about to hit myself with this hammer. Thank you guys so much for stopping by. I really appreciate it. I look forward to seeing all of you on the next episode of E-Electric Productions. And until then, game on, everyone. Bye-bye.